morning welcome back to my channel or if you guys are new here welcome my name is katie it is currently about 9 a.m i just woke up and made myself some athletic greens i've been really good about drinking these every single morning first thing instead of just like having my coffee and i feel so much better so made myself some athletic greens and then i am sitting here and ice rolling today we're doing a work from home day in my life i mean i do have a few errands so i guess it's not all technically from home but i'm taking you guys along on a work day in my life today i have a super super busy week this week i'm actually heading to go out of town to go see my boyfriend's family next week so i have like just so many loose ends and things i need to get done this week today is monday so i'm really needing to start the week off strong and get like a lot of stuff done today and i also got in a new desk if you guys remember i had an old standing desk but i didn't really love it so i got in a new one and then i also got a new office chair so i kind of wanted to like put together my whole office space maybe decorate it a little bit so we definitely have lots to get done today so i'm gonna go ahead and get started with my day while i finish drinking the rest of my athletic greens i think i'm gonna sit down kind of plan out my day write down like my whole to-do list everything that i need to get done i wanted to show you guys this new planner that i got i actually recently got it off of amazon and i'm really loving it and i feel like you guys always like whenever i share my planners that i use and i'm like a huge planner fanatic so i wanted to show you guys this one so this one's just a non-dated like daily planner and i really like it because each page is just one day and there's like a million pages in here but i really like it because it has like a little space for your top priorities and then it has a space for your to-do list you can write out whether it's done if you need to delay it take it off your to-do list has your water take a little space for notes and then my personal favorite favorite is that it has a whole like time block schedule for me that's so so helpful because that way I can make sure that I'm like staying on track just got the whole plan for the day all written out as you guys can tell like I said very busy day so my top priorities are that I need to film my work from home vlog which we're doing right now I need to go live on Amazon do the little get ready with me I need to plan the healthy vlog that I want to do so I want to do like a what I eat in a day video a little like health update everything like that so I need to plan that out I want to set up my new desk I need to run some errands I need to prep for my second Amazon live and kind of like come up with what idea I want to do for that I need to reply to all my emails because I have quite a few emails that are piling up and I know I need to like send over some updated like demographics and analytics everything like that to my manager I need to make thumbnails for my Amazon live and then I need to post coffee winners I occasionally do like little coffee giveaways on my Instagram and I haven't posted the winners yet so I need to do that and then I need to film dinner for a little like what I eat in a day like TikTok Instagram reel that I'm doing after I get my desk all set up, I wanna walk three miles on my treadmill. That's been kind of like a recent goal for me to do daily. And then I need to walk my dogs. And then I also need to self tan. And then of course there's Kaiser Duke over here and he also has a full packed schedule today. Believe it or not, he has a full packed schedule of being the most handsome boy in the entire world. And he's been up so early this morning. He started being handsome really early this morning. So he's now having to take his little beauty sleep nap so that he can get nice and recharged so that you can keep being handsome. Isn't that right? Yes, I swear. Sometimes on busy days, I really just wonder how nice it must be to be a dog, to not have to pay any bills, not to have to pay any rent, and just get us, like lay there, get the belly rubs, eat all the treats, live rent free. Must be nice. <laughs> I just got out of the shower. I'm gonna start getting ready to do my Amazon live stream. For my Amazon live stream, I decided I'm gonna do a little get ready with me. So I'm just gonna do my hair for now and then I'll like do my makeup and everything for the live stream. But I'm using some of this color. Wow, this is the Dream Coat Super Natural Spray. I really like this stuff for a heat protectant for like frizz protection. If you guys are needing to get a hair product, 10 out of 10 recommend this one. But anyways, I decided I'm going to do my live stream first because honestly, I'm super nervous about it. I've never gone live on anything before and I have like turned down this opportunity a few times in the past just because I don't know, like honestly, like live streams to me are just so intimidating. I'm so scared I'm gonna like say something awkward or just I don't know like it just I don't know they seem so uncomfortable to me kind of and I think that's just because I've never done them and I have no practice with them but when the offer came through this time I was like okay I need to like get over this whole like fear of doing lives because it's a great opportunity and I feel like it's not like that big a deal like I feel like I'm gonna do this and be like oh yeah that was like super easy I don't know why I ever 
was like scared of it in the first place. But I feel like I definitely have lots of moments where I'll like hold myself back from something just because like I'm scared of it or it's something new and it's not something I've ever done before. And it's just easy to be like, mm, no, that's like out of my comfort zone. I'm not going to do it. But I also don't ever want to just like stay in my comfort zone and not grow. So, but anyways, with all that said, I decided that I'm going to do it first thing today. So that way I don't have like the entire day to psych myself out about it and get nervous. So I'm just going to like knock it out of the way this morning. Um, I am using this Ilia Bright Start Activated Eye Cream. I really, really like this stuff. I've been using it every morning. It helps so much with like dark circles and any puffiness. I believe it has like a retinol in it or retinoid one of the two um, but I do notice just like such a big difference when I use this and also it has like a little applicator that you can just like massage it into your eyes with so I'm trying to think of like things to talk about on the live stream like in case there's any like awkward silences <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and blow dry my hair and then I'm gonna get everything set up to do the Amazon live Okay, I just finished blow drying my hair. I'm getting everything set up to start this live. I'm using this little like tripod that has a little ring light and then a little holder for my phone. I'll show you guys what it looks like with and without the light. If you guys are someone that does do content creation or you guys are interested in like getting a ring light for like pictures or something like that, you don't want like a huge one, 100% recommend this one. It can like be dimmed. You can like make it go lower and then make it go all the way up. I have it all the way up. It looks really bright on my camera because my is it this way no it's that way my exposure is turned up so it's like not as bright as it actually seems on this camera but i like it because it has like three different light settings this is i think just like the neutral one and it has a cool toned and it has a warm toned and then again just like the neutral one i personally like to shoot in the neutral one and then i turn it all the way up so anyways if you guys are looking for a good little ring light with a phone holder 10 out of 10 recommend this one but I'm gonna go ahead and do my live and I will check in with you guys whenever I'm done. Okay, I just finished doing the live. It honestly went so much better than I thought that it was gonna go. So I'm gonna give myself a round of applause for my first live not being a train wreck. Um, but yeah, no, it was totally fine. I was like more nervous than I really needed to be, but it went great. You guys tuned into it or you guys watched it. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for joining me. I know a few of you guys mentioned that you guys have watched my videos on YouTube. So thank you guys so much for tuning in and for your constant support on all platforms. I appreciate you guys so, so much. I love getting to chat with you guys. If you guys want to see any future lives, definitely make sure that you're following me on Instagram because that's where I kind of like announce it and share the link for the live. So definitely make sure that you're following over there if you guys want to catch the next one. But anyways, I'm very proud of myself for doing my first live and I think it went well. So I'm going to go ahead and clean up here because like I said, there's a huge mess everywhere. And then I'll check in with you guys right after. My doorbell just rang while I was getting ready and I got in a few super fun packages. So I thought we would do a quick little mini PR haul, but this brand sent me, first of all, I'm so excited about the little blondie brownies right off the bat, but this brand sent me a ton of different like hair care products. They also included this little card, which kind of like shows like the before and after of whenever you use these. So that's super cool, very excited to try. And then I'm also extremely excited to eat this little brownie. It's vegan and it has like very minimal ingredients but definitely gonna eat this later so that's everything in that package i'll show you guys the next one i ordered some new artwork from desenio for my kitchen and desenio is actually sponsoring today's video so thank you so much desenio for sponsoring so i got some new artwork to replace these two these ones were like diy they're okay but they weren't my favorite and i kind of wanted something that looked a little bit more like professional so i got some canvases to put up here instead so i'm gonna go ahead and unbox these and then i'll show you guys what they look like Okay, here are the two new canvases put up. I love the way they look so, so much. I'm super happy with them. I absolutely love Desenio. All of my artwork in my home and my office, like all my prints and frames, they're literally all from Desenio. I am obsessed with them and they just make the best artwork. So if you guys do want to check them out, you guys can use my discount code Katie underscore 45 and that's a 45% discount on prints and 5% off on canvases from Desenio. So definitely check them out. I am so obsessed with the way these look and absolutely love them. Okay, I just got dressed for the day. It is starting to feel like really rainy outside. Outside. It wasn't supposed to rain today, but it looks like it might and it's so humid outside I was gonna wear my hair down But then I was outside with my dogs for like 10 minutes and My hair is already getting so frizzy and huge. So we went with another sleek back bun So I guess I didn't really have to wash my hair I could have just like left it up in a bun, but that's okay Anyways, but I'm just wearing it this little black pullover that is actually from Amazon I have it in black and then I also have it in gray as well And I absolutely love these they are so comfortable. I think I got this one in a size medium So it's like a little bit more oversized 
oversized. And then I'm wearing my favorite little leggings from Amazon. I love these ones because they seriously just like snatch you in and they're so comfy. And then I'm wearing my Adidas sneakers. I think these ones are called like the Aster or something. But anyways, that's my little work from home OOTD. I think we're about to go run some errands because I kind of want to run them before it starts to rain. But first I need to go fill up my water because I have had like no water today aside from what I had in my athletic greens. Okay, I'm currently headed to the post office. Sitting in traffic, not gonna lie, I'm starting to feel like I just should not have tried to run any errands today because I went one way to go to the post office, which is the normal way that I go, and it, the traffic was backed up. I was just sitting still for like 30 minutes because the traffic was so backed up, there must have been like a wreck ahead or something. So I went around this different way, and then I normally never go this way, so I took the wrong exit, and then whenever like I turned around to go the right way on this second route to go to where I'm going, I just got a notification that there's a wreck ahead and so we're kind of just like like traffic's slowly moving but i'm going a good like two miles an hour so errands are going great so far i feel like i'm like wasting so much time and i have a lot to do today but that's okay it's fine i hope whoever is involved in these wrecks are okay and that no one is seriously injured um but yeah i need to go to ups i have some amazon returns that i need to do and then after that i need to go to best buy because i need to get a new mouse and keyboard Okay, we finally made it to our destination and after all that time and drinking so much water, I have to pee so bad. I don't know what it is, but something about like every time I run errands, I'll go to the bathroom before I leave, but then as soon as I get to a store, like I swear they put something in the air, I have to pee so bad. I'm gonna go ahead and head into UPS, drop these packages off, and then we will head over to Best Buy. Okay, got all the errands done that I needed to. I am getting a little bit hungry and I haven't had anything since breakfast. And I think there's a kava right next to me, so I'm probably gonna head over there, go grab a little kava bowl. Just got home with my kava. I got the avocado lentil bowl. This is forever my favorite bowl. It's so yummy and it's filled with veggies. It's all kind of smashed right now, but it is so, so yummy. 10 out of 10 recommend this bowl from kava, but I'm gonna eat my lunch really quickly and then I'll check in with you guys right after. Just finished eating my kava and now it is time to go ahead and set up the desk, get it all nice and organized. I wanted to show you guys this one because if you guys watched my vlogmas and you saw my last desk, this one is so much better. The other one looked pretty different in my opinion. It looked a lot higher quality in the pictures than it did in person and I just didn't love the way it looked. So this is the one that I got. I got one that actually has a drawer with it. I do have some stuff already in there, but it has great room for storage. And then I like down here that has all these buttons. It has all these areas that you can like plug stuff in and then like you can just touch it and it raises. You can touch it and it lowers and then you can like set it for like certain people to have their own settings. And I really, really love the little charging feature over here as well so i really love this desk i just got the wood one they also have one that i believe is like a hundred dollars more than this one that has like a glass top on it if you guys like that and then i also wanted to show you guys my new office chair i previously had a rolling one and then i switched to this one just because i wanted something that had a little bit of a more wide seat so that i could sit like crisscross applesauce in it and it's just a little bit more comfy and this chair is genuinely the most comfortable thing in the entire world my boyfriend actually bought it for his office and i loved it so i bought it for my own as well anyways 10 out of 10 love this chair. I could not recommend it more to anyone. It does spin and it's just like the most comfortable thing in the entire world. But let's go ahead and get my desk all set up and nice and organized. This is the final product. I love the way that it turned out. I feel like everything's just very functional, very simplistic. There's not like too much there, but I have everything that I need. I also decided to organize this little drawer because there's just so much stuff in there that I didn't need. So it was a little cluttery. So I really just put like my main necessities in here. So I have my two favorite little daily personal planners. These are just like individual sheets that you can like tear off, which is really nice. And then I have my non-dated daily planner that you guys saw earlier. I have my regular pen and then my Apple pencil. 
console. And then over here, I have my little remote for my treadmill to start it. I have a little scrunchie if I wanna put my hair up. And then I have this little blue light mist from Ilya. I actually really like it. So that is everything that I have in my drawer. It looks so much more like organized and put together and I'm really happy with it. So that is my little desk setup. Okay, now that the desk is all nice and set up, I do wanna go ahead and get some work done. I need to do like a lot of admin work, just sit down, emails some editing, all of that good stuff. But I do wanna do like a quick little check-in and see where we're at for the day, how I'm coming on my to-do list because I really do need to get like all of this knocked out. I feel like I've definitely gotten a lot done today so far, but I also feel like kind of like driving around getting stuck in traffic did kind of like push my schedule back a little bit because it is a little bit later than I was hoping for. Okay, so first thing I am doing that right now, Amazon Live, I did that. Um, have not done that. Set up new desk, just finished that. Ran errands. Um, prefer Amazon Live too. I'm gonna do that now. Emails I'm gonna do, thumbnails, that's kind of like all admin. I posted the coffee winners earlier. Okay, I'm like looking through the camera screen and I couldn't see where I was writing. Um, but I did post those earlier. Film at dinner for a what I eat in a day TikTok. Have not done that yet. Walk three miles, I'm gonna do that here in a second. Walk the dogs, can't do that because it is kind of rainy outside and then I'm gonna self tan tonight. I have drinking more water so I'm almost finished with my water. I think I'm like halfway finished. I just filled up my little cup so I drink two of these a day for all of my water intake. So have one more of those to go. But I'm definitely knocking out everything which is really good. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out my treadmill, put on my shoes so that way I can get some movement in while I'm knocking out this admin stuff. I have been working for a hot minute now. It is currently about 8.45, it's 8.42 exactly. So I'm pretty much at like the end of wrapping up my work day. I pretty much got to everything that I need to. I was like going through and like crossing off everything that I needed to do and got done. I planned an upcoming blog. I prepped for my second Amazon Live. I replied to all my emails. I created my Amazon Live thumbnails. And then I also did my three miles. I'm trying to do like three to five miles a day right now on my walking treadmill. That way like I can get in all of my steps whenever I'm also working. So that way it's not like taking up too much time whenever I do have a really busy day. So I've been absolutely loving my desk treadmill, but, but I got that done because I walk at like three miles an hour. So I got that done in an hour and then I sat down for a little bit to finish the rest of my work. But aside from that, all I really have left to do is film a dinner for a what I eat in a day. I filmed it on like the original day of eating, but then I realized that a few clips were out of focus and just weren't good quality, so I wanted to refilm it. But I just realized that I'm actually out of one of the ingredients to make that, so I, so I think I'm just gonna push that to tomorrow, and then the only other thing that I have to do is self-tan, and I'll do that like tonight after I shower and go to bed. So yeah, overall, super productive day. Very happy with like getting everything done. Super happy with like getting my desk set up. So the only other thing that I like to do before I kind of like wrap up my work day is move anything from like today's to-do list that I didn't get done over to tomorrow so that way it's already on there so I'm just gonna put down to film what I eat in a day at dinner for a TikTok and then I got everything else done so I don't have anything else to move over which is always super fun and exciting but like not having a ton of tasks to move over to the next day so but anyways I think I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up my work day here I'm gonna go relax gonna go make some dinner hang out with Austin and my pup so I hope that you guys found this vlog useful and enjoyed it thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video bye guys Kaiser Dugenstein's for all of the other entrepreneurs out there who would like to just work as hard as you do at being handsome. What advice do you have for them? Can you share any tips with us on how to make a living being handsome? I don't think he's open for questions right now. Okay, we might have to revisit that a little bit later.